What's up, heroes? Today, I'm headed to the book launch for the new Descendants book, Rise of the Isles of the Lost. I'm gonna get to interview Dove Cameron and the author, Melissa Del Cruz. I'm cosplaying as Carlos today, so I'm gonna go get ready, and then we're gonna head out. All right, you guys, check it out. We are here. I'm super excited. I'm actually headed over right now to my interview with Dove Cameron and Melissa De La Cruz. I'm super excited. What's up, guys? Chris here. I am with Dove Cameron and Melissa De La Cruz. So, um, Melissa, in the books and in the Descendants universe, we get to meet a lot of Disney characters that we wouldn't normally meet. Yes. Um, in Rise of the Isles of the Lost, are there any new characters that we're going to see for the first time? Yes, we have three hot new characters. We have Uma, uh, who's the daughter of Ursula. We have Harry Hook, who's the son of Captain Hook. And then we have Gil, who's the son of Gaston. So I might have to throw in some more cosplays now. <laughs> yes. <laughs> By the way, Thank amazing. you, thank you. I decided I would dress for the occasion today, so no, I No, it's very like much... perfect. Thank like, you. Like, wow, it's actually genuinely like perfect. <laughs> I know. It's the more you look at them, like, yeah. that's exactly and what you needed. needed. That's, that's the nice from you guys. So, Doug, you've gotten to play Mal in The First Ascendance. You also voice um, Mal in the animated series. What has been your favorite part of this whole Descendants journey? Honestly, filming the second movie. Really? It was my favorite. Because in a lot of ways, like, the first movie is kind of like, I mean, it, it, it's like how people say, like, what's your favorite episode of like a show that you did? It's like sure. the pilot, aka, like, the first movie will always have, like, a special place for you because that's where you figured everything out. Yeah. But the second movie, like, those three months were, like, some of the three best months of, like, my whole life. I know that that's, like, a big thing to say, but it was it was just, like, the time of my life. I think it was the time of all of our lives. That's so cool. Yeah. Melissa, this is your third book. Yes. Out of all of the Descendants books, oh my goodness, mm -hmm. who's your favorite character and why? Ooh! No pressure, no pressure, with certain no pressure. No. <laughs> it's a <about> bad <laughs> Um, You know, it's really hard to choose. It's like they're all my children. Sure. You know, and definitely Mal, and because you know my daughter. Me too. Like, right? <laughs> hey. Come on. But of the new book, Harry Hook was really fun to write. Me too. Not right, but he's my favorite one. <laughs> he's my favorite one. I feel like that's going to be a really cool character for Yeah, no, I mean, he's just really, like, naughty, he's just, like, the perfect bad boy. Yeah, right? yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, Melissa, mm -hmm. you've had a new Descendants book coming out consecutively every year for the last three years. Yes. What is that like for you as a writer? And, like, do you want to talk a little <laughs> bit about the process? <laughs> Let's just talk about No Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, we always joke, the book is always doing Thanksgiving. No, Christmas Eve. Yeah. Sure, sure. Um, you know, it's really fun. I, I, I was a big Disney kid, so I loved the whole Disney universe. And to be able to be part of it, you know, it was great. And I outline a lot. So basically, we, you know, we work on the outline, then I do a really quick first draft, and then we do a lot of revisions, so. Duh. Mal seems like a super fun character to play. Yeah. Do her adventures in the book influence you at all on how you play her on screen? You know, okay, so this is such a cool thing about this whole franchise world thing that we created yeah. is it's like really communal like when it comes to like Melissa and Kenny and all of the cast it's almost like we're all sort of doing this one big motion together and then it's sort of like oh that's how it turned out like that yeah and I don't think that as an audience people really know yeah. how much Kenny, our director, and the actors, and Melissa, I don't think they all know how much we're all involved in it. Sure. But it is sort of like we're like playing pretend in our backyard, and then it somehow ends up in Disney Channel. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, definitely. Melissa, besides writing books, because clearly you're very busy writing <laughs> plot books, yes. what are some of your other hobbies that you like to do on your spare time? You know, I, I have a 10-year-old uh, daughter, so I spend a lot of time with my family. Hello. And you know, really, I have no hobbies. That's my <laughs> hobby. <laughs> That's going to be weird that you're putting your full time into it. That's right. Duh. Yes. I just get so nervous. Every time you say, we're going to watch the game show. I know. And who's next? So you keep very, very busy with your work on the Disney Channel. Yeah. Um, with, with Maddie, obviously the Descendants, and with your outside projects. Yeah. If and or when you get a day off, because I'm sure they they don't come often. Right. What is your perfect day? You just sent me there. <laughs> I just sent you there. Like, day off. Like, what is that? that? <laughs> um, my perfect day off. Well, okay. So I've never been this girl to be like so cheesy like this. Sure. 
because I'm always like, ah. But I would better be with my boyfriend. Okay. okay. I would. It would take the time. Well, because here's the thing. I'm a firm believer of like your significant other being your best friend. Yeah. He is. He's like my best friend. Yeah. And we just have like the most fun. We're st stupidly compatible. <laughs> so like, he, you know, it's, it's like hanging out with my my best friend. Yeah. So I would be with him. Like a lot of cars. You, 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 a lot <laughs> of cars to be involved. Of course, necessary things. Yeah. Things. Sleeping in, like feeding the birds. I don't know. It'd be in, I'd probably probably be in Manhattan. All right, you guys. Well, I'm so glad I got to interview you guys and to join you for the big release of this new book. Make sure you guys go check it out. All right, you guys. Until next time, we love you guys so much. We love you so much. We love you so we much. We love you so much. And until next time, see ya.